The Workers' Party chairman Sylvia Lim has dismissed National Development Minister Ma Bao Tan's assertion that her party's proposals on housing would crash the market. She says the proposals are confined to new flats, which cater to a limited market and so will have limited impact. The Workers' Party says its proposal to price new flats according to median incomes will have a minimum impact on the resale market because the resale market attracts not just first-time home buyers. In addition, new HDB flats are subject to strict criteria before they can be bought and sold, which limits the spillover effect on resale prices. Ms Sylvia Lim says this proposal is based on real ground concerns. I mean, if we go back to the government's main role as a provider of public housing, HDB, affordability should be the main thing that they're concerned about. I mean, let's go back to the fundamentals, you know. You still have to come back to incomes and, and to see whether people are able to afford uh, the flats and how long it will take for people to pay for those flats. The party also introduced five first-time candidates today. Businessman Peng Eng Huat, financial consultant Muhammad Fasli Talib, Sajeev Kamala Sanan, a partner in interior design firm, social worker Frida Chan, and aviation consultant Watson Chong. Watson Chong was emotional as he recounted his father-in-law's concerns for his safety and for his family. You have two young children. Why don't you spend time with them? Mr. Chong says he wasn't concerned about repercussions on himself. It's not about me, it's about my loved one, how they would suffer if I were to go down. Others had a different experience. My family is 100% uh, support, uh, supportive of this. Uh, when I told my daughter I'm with the Workers' Party, she said, all right. You know? <laughs> <laughs> the Workers' Party has said it will contest in four group representation constituencies and four single-seat wards. That's 23 candidates in all. Now, including its chairman and secretary general, it has so far unveiled 19 candidates and is set to formally introduce its last batch tomorrow. And this will include its much-talked-about candidate, Chen Shoumao.